The organization demands that I talk of my concerns of Steins Gate Zero not living up to the marks? Well, if that's the choice of Steins Gate, activate code SG0. Anyhow, hello, my name is uh, Cool Guy for you, and um, I just want to uh, do a awfully short video on uh, my concerns for Steins Gate Zero. I'm worried, essentially, that it's not going to live up to what everything Steinsgate was. <clears throat> so, this contains spoilers of Steinsgate, so if you haven't seen Steinsgate, uh, do not watch this video. Do not watch the video. It contains spoilers. Anyhow, you know, Steinsgate, I find, set the bar high, you know. Um, and I'm worried that Steinsgate Zero is going to be a letdown in comparison, that it's not going to be able to encompass everything that Steinsgate was and be so much more. It, it's, it's really hard to outdo the original. So, but anyhow, just shortly I want to say that, you know, I saw some spoilers for Steinsgate Zero. I didn't want to see them, but I saw them. So, due to stupid titles and thumbnails on YouTube, which I didn't want to see, you know, I wanted Steins Gate Zero to be completely blind, um, so thanks for that, whoever that was. Um, now I know two, the two characters, uh, spoilers, 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 skip like 10 seconds, um, two characters, time travel, darn. Um, so anyhow, 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 that, that's not going to be 10 seconds, one, two, three, four, five, okay, maybe now. So anyhow, um, you know, um, Steins Gate, and here I go into the components a bit, but, you know, Steins Gate had cliffhangers, you know, glorious cliffhangers, uh, endless ones, which, you know, drove us forward in, you know, hype and suspense and, you know, just taking it so seriously. Um, you know, they need to deliver on those again. Uh, you know, for example, like episode one, episode, I think, uh, what was it, 11 or 12, where there's a big event, and then um, episode 15, and there's just so many. It's just like every episode was a dang cliffhanger. They need to be able to do that kind of thing again. Um, so how do you outdo that? I don't know. Um, you know, Steins Gate, uh, my favorite thing, um, you know, had big mystery. It had big, big mystery from the get-go, and that's what absolutely drove me as well with this series. Um, it was so confusing the first time around, you know, with episode one, um, you know, Kurisu alive, then dead, then alive. Um, it was it was a really good first episode, and that's what... Uh, that's what kind of hooked me is the mystery so um but now however being past steins gate and awaiting steins gate zero we are seemingly familiar to it all now so how can they drive home the mystery and uh you know how can they bring in new concepts to confuse us you know i don't necessarily think they can bring in new wacky time travel stuff even though that would be neat, but I, I don't think that's the route that's going to be taken. Um, and a, a huge negative, in my opinion, is um, essentially that we we know the ending. Uh, that's a big beef to me, and a negative I find. Um, that's not that's not good for the plot. Uh, it's a huge spoiler to know how something ends. So they need, I think they need some sort of compensation type elements in there in replacement to fill that kind of a void in the, in the, what you're supposed to not know of the plot. But now we, we know, with considering Steins Gate, so how can they fix that? How can they fix that? I don't know. I don't know. How can they compensate that? Because that's that's huge. That's like going to starting any TV show or any movie and knowing how it ends. Um, but 
anyhow, uh, a couple more points down, I'll get to what I think the compensation might be. Um, you know, Steinsgate, though, had big reveals. It had big reveals, and it was so hype-worthy and uh, all that, and, you know, taken serious and, uh, for me, which was good. Um, you know, from, you know, Kreisu being alive at the end of episode one uh, to the reveal of John Titer in, I think, <clears throat> episode 15. Um, and then, well, technically also the reveal in episode 11 or 12 or whatever uh, with the bad guy person. Um, so, you know, what I find is that Steins Gate Zero needs needs to have these big reveals awaiting us. And that's tricky given we know how once again how things end. So I think it's tricky. It's it's kind of just like a how we get there kind of thing. Um so um and maybe I am being a bit off center about this whole thing. Maybe quite simply Steinsgate Zero uh, doesn't need to be all that Steinsgate was and will instead be different due to the world line. And um, I'll make more of a point about that in a moment. Um, you know, um, and with uh, Steinsgate, there were dangers in Steinsgate. There were threats. There were there was risk. There was uh, you know, there became a perceived danger pretty much anywhere. Um, how can they, you know, how can they do that again while keeping it kind of balanced? Um, you know, that danger, I think, might need to be perceived again, have like a constant threat around or something, because it is that different world line. Um, yeah, given the world line, it it may be true as can be this that idea of mine uh one where cern rules the world and is still on the prowl like a lion searching for its prey who delve into time travel they keep control of it so yeah i think there's going to be much more dangers um which will increase the tension and suspension or suspense i guess um and i think the biggest compensation where the biggest potential is with Steins Gate Zero is um, that world line itself. It's perhaps it's perhaps the best thing they can, you know, tap water out of essentially. If they show off that grand uh, world line and in dark ways, I think that's going to be a big payoff. You know, I see that as the you know biggest perceived gem. Uh, element of Steins Gate Zero to show off that other world line in a full extent. Show it off. Show it off. Go along with all the emotions. Uh, all that. So so how can Steins Gate outdo all that Steins Gate encompassed? You know, this is, that. that's why the you know, movie wasn't as great either as Steins Gate because it didn't encompass all that Steins Gate was the whole experience that Steins Gate was. That's why the, I don't think the movie was as good. It was still it was still good. It was just wasn't as good as Steins Gate because it didn't encompass all that Steins Gate was and it was had to be different. Uh, Steins Gate Zero is going to have to be different. It's just how it is. Uh, you got the original and then the next bit trying to be as good or better. Um, so, in a world line where Kurisu and Mayuri die and the world heads towards World War III, I think the best potential is to come up with ways uh, with ways detailed how to be what Steinsgate was. So, detailed ways how to be what Steinsgate was, but also to be different uh, with that world line, showing vast vast, vast, vast differences. Uh, it, it's just hard to outdo the original, and I have my doubts on Steins Gate Zero. Uh, some people have said it's it's as good, but I I can't wait to see. Um, 
So I find they have to play up, you know, a lot of mystery somehow written in. I think they del need to deliver uh, them cliffhangers uh, somehow written in. And I think they need to have some big reveals like Steins Gate has had as well. So those need to be written in. I don't know what those could be or would be. Um, but I believe and hold that the key to Steins Gate Zero living up to Steins Gate is the world line itself, which was left unexplored in Steins Gate and is the point of Steins Gate Zero um, to show off an in-between moment from Steins Gate. So how, to get, how does he get to point A to B, essentially? Um, or more like uh, M to N or whatever the case or J to K or whatever um, so I hope it can be all what we expect and more the bigger question is what do you guys think um, what are your concerns with Steins Gate Zero do you agree with me do you not agree with me um, does it need to be like Steins Gate and surpass itself or will it simply just shine or outshine Steinscape with the you know alternative world line which is much darker all right now we're getting towards the end that's good I, I make long videos and ramble on don't I um, <laughs> um, don't spread rumors but I'm slowly recording a commentary on Steinscape in preparation for also doing such for Steins Gate Zero. Um, with the latter, you'll see me go absolutely nuts with blind hype for the former, you know, isn't blind. Um, so, now that's pretty much the end of it. So, that is all for now, my anime pondering friends. El Sai Kangaroo. Or was it Congress? Whatever. Kangaroo. Elsai Kangaroo. Take her cool.